need to call plus one. Plus yeah. one will send you one. Plus one, yeah. We call one plus. One. We're gonna call one plus, and we're gonna get them to give you a free phone because you deserve it. Because we need do everything. A free, we need a free phone now. Yeah. <laughs> it's very rich time. Yeah, that's it. That's it. So. What, one question I already asked you, but I want you to, to, to answer everyone. You sold, you started in Bitcoin when? Because everyone believes, Diddy, that you started at like the middle of or end of 2017. You really started um, when? I really started mining in 2013. I sold a lot of my Bitcoins in 2014 at the first crash, fell on to 200. Yeah. But of course I had. Bitcoins left, and yeah. of course I had millions of uh, dope coins left. You yeah. know? And I was a bag holder in the dope coins, and up to 2017 I didn't do anything again. But then I started investing in February 2017 around uh, almost 1200 dollars, 1300 dollars. Nice. And that was where I sold my cars, and I ended up with my last invest investment was my pension fund. It was like 60, 61. Yeah, 6.1. You worried it's not going to come back anytime soon? I don't care. You don't care. <laughs> I really there we go. Care. Doesn't care. It will go up, man. In my, it's, it's my vision. It's the same as it was when I started. There will be a point where you will reach 100k, 200k. Yep. And maybe it will take two years. Maybe it will take five years. Or ten. In my opinion, we will go, probably we will go up a little bit now. Go down to 2k. And in the end, we will end up 40k in two years' time. I can see that. So maybe in five years' time, 100k or 200k. So if I have five bitcoins left in five years' time, let's call it the five-five rule. <laughs> five bitcoins in five years' time, we have a million. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and, 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 and the last thing is, um, what what is the 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 What's the point of you doing all this stuff? Like, why are you doing all the all of this with with Bitcoin and traveling the world? Like, what's your goal? Like, your, your end game? My end game is uh, we don't have an end game. We just want to be happy. Yeah. I needed to change life. I was very materialistic, workaholic, and I wanted to show my kids they could be happy uh, with not all the materialistic stuff. Yeah. Just by living life and helping others. And that's what we are shifting to now. We are called the Bitcoin family, yep. but it's not our family. I want to make a huge Bitcoin family. All people that support Bitcoin, and with this, I want to support all people all over the world. That's so it. We travel to charities. We did not stop to charities. We just came from Copenhagen. We, we had two bags full of toys and clothes. It's just started to lay the kids over there. That's awesome. Um, so for us, the motto in crypto should be sharing is caring. So sharing no is Lamborghinis scary. and mooning. We are about yeah. sharing is caring. So if you make like so much money with crypto trading, you know, all the big traders out there, you make tons of money. You is it for good? Give 10K to, to the poor people in Africa and Absolutely. learn them. We, we go to the charity, we teach them how to set up a QR code or a Bitcoin wallet with a QR code. We put it on the website and then we communicate outside here. You can support this charity with Bitcoin as well. Yeah? Yeah. Um, so for us, it's just living life, teaching our kids to live a freedom life, not being captured in this imprisonment of the government, yeah. and uh, yeah, just help help spread the way, the, the wealth a little bit more. So it's awesome. This, this I, respect <laughs> that, I respect that. I respect that. We need those guys as well. Yeah, not just absolutely. the levels. Hundred <laughs> percent.